Hello guys, what's up? This is Dinkar Chaudhary back with another video and in this video I'm going to tell you how you can live stream on YouTube in 1080p without any watermark with internal audio. So let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go to Play Store and then you need to search for this app called Turnip. If you don't find it on Play Store, you can just go to Google and search for the Turnip APK and you can install it easily on your Android device. Now the next thing is, you know, it's very simple to set it up. You just have to click on Get Started. It's the uh, simple procedure. Then you have to click on Set Up Stream. You have to select any game you want. Even if you don't have it installed, you can just click on it and then click on Next. Then you click on Continue anyway if you don't have the game. Then on the next screen, you have to, you know, edit your description and your title so I won't be doing it now just for the sake of the tutorial I'll just click on next on the next page you have the option to choose the stream quality based on your internet connection you can choose 360p 480p 720 1080p or 240 whichever you want then you have the option to select YouTube or Facebook if you want to click on YouTube then click on YouTube and log in with your YouTube account I have already done it so I'll be giving it the camera permission and the microphone permission you can switch on or off your camera according to your needs if you want the webcam or not then you have a very good feature in this app as well that you, you can add overlays there are predefined overlays in it that you can edit according to your needs you can add Instagram Twitter your mobile number your paytm number to get donations or anything like that i have already done it i'll be showing you some more overlays as well so you can add them according to your needs you can choose any one of those overlays that are already predefined in this app um, uh, let's just have a look at some more overlays you just have to click on that uh, button and then you'll have to you know you'll have the option to choose from those overlays I, I specifically like the red one so i'll be choosing that for the sake of this video as soon as you click on any overlay you'll have the option to edit it according to your needs you can add your instagram you can add your mobile number i have already done it so i'll just click on save as you can see the overlay has been added to the bottom of the screen so that's the predefined space that it is added to you'll have that overlay on the bottom of the screen now the, on the next page you can just click on start streaming let's just have an overview of the overlay till that time you can see that how it looks like we'll, i'll be also showing you showing you the live stream that how it actually looks like on your phone so you know you'll have to give uh, it the permission to draw over other apps we have already seen that happening with all the streaming apps that we have tried we also saw it happening with stream labs then uh, we had omelet arcade as well i'll be m you know making some more videos on live streaming then you have to press on that button to actually go live you'll have to press that and your screen will go live as soon as you click on that button now uh, it says that we are live let's just uh, check it on youtube we'll move on to youtube and now we'll search for our live stream so now you can see we are live on YouTube uh, on one screen we have the game working and we are live from that on the other screen screen we have YouTube open and I'll be showing you the screen look how beautiful the overlay is looking on that screen and the screen is actually completely live now you have the option to increase or decrease the internal audio according to your needs you just have to click on that button and you just you can just swipe up and down then you have to switch on the off the microphone you can just click on click that one button and you can switch the microphone on and off so that's how it works and this app also has the shield mode so we'll be trying it out as well if you want to look out for some chat if you have missed out on some chat you can click on the chat button to get an overview of the chat i'll just send a message hi and you can see that chat message will pop up on my screen you can see that dinkar shaudhry says hi on the top so as soon as anyone clicks on um, your live stream and if, if they send any chat or you know any text message uh, that that text message will pop up on your screen for a few seconds if you have missed it out or missed out on it you can just click on the chat button to look forward to it now there is a shield mode as well as soon as you switch on the shield mode uh, it will say that the stream is paused as you can see on the live stream right now it says the stream will be right back and uh, as soon as i switch off the shield mode uh, again my stream will resume so let's just wait for a few more seconds and then you will see that the stream has been resumed so you can see the live stream has been re resumed as soon as switched off the shield mode so you know this this app also has the shield mode capability in the free version itself so everything is free right now this app is in early access it's going really good and i hope it continues to grow you can also join their discord server if you have any kind of a problem and the developers are very keen to answer your questions so you know this is this this has been a very good app for me it has been a very good alternative to all those apps like somnit arcade and stream labs which are actually you know uh, taking those subscriptions to remove that watermark and to give out the 1080p capability so this turns out to be a very good alternative for me a very good option for me so guys thank you so much for watching the video i hope you like the video click the like and subscribe button if you found this video helpful and share for more videos like this